baby, you making me nervous. Go to your old yeah, I'm purging. Hopping in the yeah, I'm swerving. Wait, walking that money, I spent 50 G's. Big world's all about me. We're rich forever, be my team. All these niggas wanna be. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What's poppin' team? Me, it's your girl Elizabeth M, aka the vlogger. Do not forget to like, subscribe, comment for all of my vlogs, challenges, reactions, all that good stuff. And if you missed some videos, I'm gonna put some of the good ones in the description. I got y'all. But today we're gonna be doing a get to know me tag. I know y'all have seen me post some videos, but like, who the are you? Who are you? You just stepping out on the scene and like, Bria, who are you? I'm gonna get the laptop. Like, I found a few questions on this website and we're gonna see. But I'm gonna tell y'all. You know, questions that no one really asks you, but it's pretty weird or cool to know that about them. That's what we're going for. So this website I'm using is called Root Report and they gave you a whole intro like I know all that. Okay, so question number one. Are you named after anyone? My grandmother's middle name is Elizabeth. When was the last time you cried? Y'all ain't gonna cry because your girl is a G. Who's a G2? I guess I give this video a like because we don't cry. <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> do you have kids? If no, how many do you want? I have no children, as although people really believe that I do and they're just rumor going around. Like, y'all are sad because I don't have no kids. People see me post my nephew and they, I guess they assume that that's my son, but no. Like I said, it's my nephew. How many do you want? I guess whenever I find like a husband or whatever, you can decide on that. It doesn't really matter. If you were another person, would you be a friend of yourself? Why not? Why not? Like, I'm wrong. Like, I don't know if y'all have seen my personality. I try to be as transparent as possible during videos. But I'm an ecstatic, loving, outspoken person. Like, I love me. I, I'm, I love me. Okay? Do you use sarcasm a lot? Do I look like I use sarcasm a lot? What's the first thing you notice about people? I probably notice their sh like on females, I notice their body. If that makes sense. I'm not homosexual, but if a girl has like an eye like shape, I will notice. For guys, I notice their haircuts. Do the shape up. But other than that, personality. If I don't like your personality, I can't, I can't fuck with you, I can't, I can't. Scary movie or happy endings? I love a good horror. Favorite smell? Gas. Does anybody like the smell of gas? Like, if you do, let me know in the comments because people, when I tell people that, they think it's weird. But I'm like, like have you smelled gas before? <laughs> it's a good thing. Although I know it's, it's not good to inhale. I know, I know, I know. What's the furthest thing you've ever been from home, I think they mean where. Brothers have been from home. Like when I go with family, like Orlando and stuff, I guess. That's what they mean. When were you born? I was born on January 5th, 2001. People think I'm old, but I'm really not. I was born in 2000. Glory to verse and bubbles. What's your, what's your zodiac sign? Do you believe in it? I'm um, apparently, I'm a Capricorn, but I don't really keep up with it. Like I have this friend named Charisma, and like she knows so much about astrology and I like really but do I believe in it? I I don't know. I, I really do not know. But as far as I'm concerned, I'm a Capricorn. Or Capricorn, whatever. What are your hobbies? Vlogging! That's my number one hobby. Um reading, writing, movies. I love nighttime movies. Like I love a good crazy boyfriend like stalking his ex and killing the children and like someone always dies or ends up in an asylum in lifetime movies and I love it. What do you want to be when you grow up? Well, I'm currently in school doing psychology. I would like to be a criminal psychologist but everyone knows that I have a huge love for media and videos and everything so I honestly prefer that that goes. I mean both to do well but I really would love for me yeah, to do extremely well for me. So, you know, let's just pray on it. Like, pray for me, guys. Pray for me. Guys. How tall are you? I am 5'1". I know in pictures I may look a bit tall. Oh, yeah. Follow me on Instagram, by the way, at Eva Vlogger. But I'm actually just a little rigid. And I'm very loud, so people expect for me to be big and tall. But I'm actually thick and short. 
but I don't mean to take it past me because I will like the last album. I will. Ask my friends. I'm very feisty. What is the least favorite thing about yourself? That's hard. That's hard. I I don't know. You know when you have like such an extreme love for yourself, it's like there's something on me not to like. I don't know. But I can't ask my question, but if I really, really have to, I would say my nose because I, I have a really big nose and it's like somewhere I'm so irritated, especially in pictures when I smile, you know, it's like really big. That's probably one of the things. What phone do you have? What was that? What phone do you have? My close friends. <laughs> my close friends, no. But <laughs> I have an Android. I still enjoy an iOS nation. It's fine. How many boyfriends or girlfriends have you had? None of your business. <laughs> None. What's your talent? I feel as though my talent is videography and video making because outside of YouTube, I do videography for weddings, events, and everything. So I have a huge passion and talent for videography and editing and all that good stuff. So. I would think that's my talent. I think that's a talent that I have. One word that describes you loud. Loud and pretty. But I didn't really say one, but loud and pretty. Are you an extrovert or an introvert? Um, I have off days, so sometimes I'm an introvert, and then others I'm like flamboying, like, hi, hello. And then there's other days I'm like, don't touch me. Don't bother me. I don't know y'all. Antisocial. Go away. So. It balances. Do you consider yourself a good cook? I don't consider myself a good cook, sweetie. I consider myself a great cook. I could cook. And uh, if you're from the Caribbean, you know a lot of times your parents teach you how to cook from young. So I gotta cook from like the ninth grade. And they're like, whew. So I've had a lot of practice. If money were no object, what would you get for your next birthday? What would I want? I really would like to buy my own home if I really, you know, like, you know, really, really, they say money was an object, so my next birthday, I'd like to be a young home owner, a car paid for, that's like what you really want, because I want to move, but I can't, obviously, and of course, if I'm going to move away from my parents, I need transportation, so a car and a home. I'll keep the clothes, y'all can keep those jewelry, the makeup, hair products, nigga. Like, uh, I trying to establish myself and money was an object. What's your favorite thing to have for breakfast? Call me crazy, but I have stopped eating breakfast from like the eighth grade. I know that's not healthy. Y'all not for school me. I know. I'm trying to get back into it. I don't know, I just stopped. I just started to eat lunch more. Three things that make me happy. I love cameras, clothes and money those are three things that make me happy that's one of your bad habits procrastination i will wait till the last hour to do something before i have to do and i know that's terrible but i always get it done it gives you a drive all procrastinators know that it gives you like a like a like a huge it gives you a huge drive to do something i don't know I, I, and it's like hard to help it like oh i can't what sports do you play i look like i play any sports I'm tired just even thinking about it. What is your favorite drink? I love Sprite soda and I love the guava fizz from Wendy's. I love that. How many countries have you visited? I've only went to one, that's in the United States. Do I have any siblings? I have four siblings. I'm three brothers and a sister. Crazy girl, like she's not from that. If you could live anywhere in the world, where would it be? I honestly, people would say that Dubai is expensive. I like, I haven't visited Dubai. I don't think I would like live there. Hmm, I have to think about that. Where would I live? How is your relationship with your parents? Like, me and my parents are fine. We have little bickers here and there, but we're fine. Three things that upset me. I don't like being ignored. I don't like when I'm being forced. I don't like when I'm disrespected. I just take those people who say things are uh, cringe, like 
piss me off. That cringe thing. Just don't do it. Just don't. Don't do that. Just don't do that. Don't ignore me. Like that. That's a huge thing for me. Don't ignore me. Doing it. Do I have any pets? I have a cat. Her name is Kingsley. It sounds very boyish. It's a sheep or kitty. Y'all have probably seen it in my vlog. She's sleeping. Are you left handed or right handed? Right handed. Right handed. My favorite memory from my childhood. One of my favorite memories from my childhood would probably have to be when I did a poem competition when I was nine and I won the money. Like I, like I went against a bunch of adults because a lot of people know that I'm actually telling you. I have been writing a lot from I was in like the third grade and I love writing. And I love to comprehend. So I did a poem for Father's Day in front of the entire mall and I won. My poem was the best and I went up against like 30 year olds and 40 year olds and 70 year olds But <laughs> I did that and I won the money and I went and bought a camera. So I like I told you already, I have, I have always loved videography and videos and things like this is really what I want to do. What is your eye color? Can you see it? It's brown, dark brown. I want to wear contacts, but for whenever I do that, eyes blink and the contact will fall on the ground. If it falls on the ground, I get fed up, I stamp on it, and I need to wear it. That's life. What is your favorite food? Ooh, that's a hard question. I love food. Just give me it. Once it tastes good, just give me it. Like, listen, that's it. That's it. What is your favorite holiday? My favorite holiday is Christmas, and it's coming up. It's coming up. Yay. So y'all should be expecting a Christmas room makeover because I'm gonna be painting my room over, redecorating it, all of that stuff. So stay tuned for that video. What is your favorite gadget? My favorite gadget is probably my phone because like it's so convenient. You can go on everything from your phone, email, social media, communication. Like it's so nifty. That and I really want to buy an iPad for school. Like something keep moving the store and it's just like no. Then. Where did you grow up? I'm growing up in Nassau, Bahamas, that is in the Atlantic Ocean, near Florida, in the Caribbean. I hope I explained that. Nassau is in New Providence. Oh, I forgot this is a social study, it's fine, but Nassau, Bahamas. What is your biggest fear? Flying roaches. I will have a panic attack if I'm going to fly on me. Listen, just be, call Ambalam just because you know, I can't. My favorite music genre, trap. I know you've heard my intro. I know you probably had background music for this video because one like it will be trap or something hip hop or rap. I love it. it. It's my favorite. Are you more likely to avoid conflict or engage it head on? I am addressing you. I address. Ain't no leave nothing. Ain't no leave nothing. We can talk for this. Sis. We can talk for this, bro. I can I can't avoid things. I, I have to talk about it. Do what I fight? Not me. I don't do the, the, the fighting thing like it's a bit much to me, but we will I have to speak. I have to speak my mind. Can you dance? Hey, y'all something from I can't. I can't. I can't. It's, it's too much. So y'all, that is just a few things about me, a few things you've got to learn about me. I hope you don't find me to be that's all I really have to say. Look, uh, baby, you making me nervous. Go to your old yarn purge. Hopping in the yam swerve. Uh, wait, I'm walking out my day, I spent 50 G's. Big world's all about me. Rich forever be my team. All these niggas wanna be.